You know what this set is right here? It's not a fall for fail deck. It's hope. Hope that we can change something in the LEGO community that affects us all. We all want this. Now, the Ninjago CMF was a fail. I did not want that. There was not a lot of desire around it. Let's be honest. It was just a bunch of Ninjago fans who really wanted it. Not trying to turn you off, but there just wasn't enough of fans for the movement, okay? Black Marines, it wasn't a movement, but it also falls in the same category of the Ninjago CMF. There's not enough fans for it. I mean, personally, I would love Galactic Marines. But they'd be really cool. But there's not enough fans for it. But Phase 2 Cody, as a minifigure, there is. If you don't believe me, because I have a small sub count and I'm not that important. If you don't believe me, ask some of my friends. Here, I did for you. Lego, so do you know who Obi-Wan's right-hand man was? Well, Anakin, I guess. Do you know who his number two man was? It was Commander Cody. We got Captain Rex, but not Cody. That is very weird. Also, we should have got him in this set. Actually, this is the older version, but we should have got him. Lego, if you want money, do yourself a favor and make yourself a Commander Cody. It's a no-brainer. Come on Lego, we need a phase 2 Cody. You've had two opportunities missed so far. You could have put one in the Grievous Starfighter, you could have put one in the UCS Gunship, but it doesn't even look like we're going to get one in there yet, so I really think we definitely need a phase 2 Cody. Guys, 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 we need a phase 2 Commander Cody. Now, this is for a number of reasons. First off, they made a buildable character of Commander Cody, and for some reason, they didn't make a minifigure. Like, why would you make a minifigure but not a character? It's, it's so dumb. Um, but aside from that, we need one because we've already gotten a Phase 2 Captain Rex, which they need to do. That, that, that's even more important than Commander Cody, but that's not what I'm here to talk about. Commander Cody is a must. You must have him. I, I cannot emphasize this enough. Um, but aside from that, we need like three separate videos on, on why they need a Commander Cody, not like specifically targeted for that. Um, but yes, like, like literally, like I, I have needed to buy, I, I've needed to buy four separate custom Commander Codys. There's four right in that corner, right there. I should not have to do that. Lego, you should do better. Come on, guys. So, as you can see, that a lot of people would like a Phase 2 Cody. This was the last movement, and I think people have really been searching for a new movement to go behind. Like, Ryan wasn't even sure, I'm pretty sure. Like, I mean, I know there's things Ryan, MR Productions, the creator of the Fall for Battle Pack movement, really wants, but he says he's out of it for now. I don't believe that. But maybe it's time to get back into it. So, I propose this. Start the hashtag, we want a Phase 2 Cody. I'm going to get every single person in this community involved in this movement. I am going to shout out to every single LEGO influencer who I admire in the community. I am going to at them with this video. I'm going on Instagram. I'm going to at them. They are going to see this message. And if they don't want to hop on, then they're going to be left behind. So make your videos. Get it out there that we are going to make a Phase 2 Cody minifigure. Not the billable figure just in case, you know, LEGO may get confused. We don't want that. We want a minifigure, and we don't want something like Mario in, um, what's it called form? Not even going to get into it. We want a minifigure, pure minifigure. We got Phase 1 Cody, and he's desirable. If you look on Bricklink, his price is pretty expensive. And that just shows you, think about it, Phase 2 Troopers are always really expensive. Just think how well a Phase 2 Cody would sell. Now, for the set... I don't really care what set it is because we've gotten so many great sets from LEGO and I really do thank LEGO for making an amazing summer wave with Bogotan, Gar Saxon, all these Clone Wars sets and Mandalorian sets. They're absolutely amazing. 17 plus new figures in the new wave alone. But we're still missing my boy old Commander Cody. 21 years LEGO has been around with no Phase 2 Cody. And it's honestly quite sad. So... This possible set we could get Phase 2 Cody in is make a play skill recolored gunship. Even though there is a UCS one coming out, make a play skill recolored gunship. Like, everyone wants one. Like, well, not everyone, but a lot of people want a play skill gunship. At least that I know. And I think it shows by the eBay price. Or maybe make an ATT. Like, when was the last time we got a regular ATT? I know 2015 Rebels ATT, but that doesn't really count. I'm talking about an official Clone Wars style ATTE. We all love that set. 
I love it personally. I know this, I'm not speaking for everyone in the community, but personally, I love the set. That'd be a great set for it. But if you didn't want to go so big, just honestly, I hate to say this because it's a main character in a battle pack, but I want to face two Cody so bad that I personally would be willing to have him in a battle pack. Even though he's a main character, I want a face to Cody. And I know everyone else does too. I was inspired to make this video by Maddie's Mayfig comment to Lego on the post. And here's what it says. So, the Lego company made this post on Instagram called LegoCon. It's a thing that's coming up. It's an event. And they're asking us what questions would we want to ask designers. And I don't think Lego's going to answer the question about Phase 2 Cody for a numerous reasons. Now, it is the most liked post on the Instagram page. And they're always starting to answer some of these questions down below in the comments. And I'll just scroll by it. At the top, we see questions like, Where's the phase two cozy? All that stuff and Luke's Landspear. The question is that they don't want answer. Like it's just kind of crazy that they're avoiding all those questions. Now if we go to the bottom, we see all these other p questions that are just like okay, like one like two like, and they're answering those. Like they're not even paying attention to the fact of all these other questions which have a ton of likes at the top, but they're answering all of these down below. And maybe they're saving them for LegoCon, but I highly doubt they are. So yeah, that's just something I found to be a little off. And a whole bunch of people in the community tried to get this post to be the most liked post in the community because we wanted this to happen. Like, I remember there people like Dilly Figs, Leo Stars, Miniac, um, myself, and we just wanted to get this post to get liked up, you know, make Lego answer it. And they're still avoiding it no matter what happens. Even though it has like 700 likes combined, it's just kind of ridiculous. Heck, I even did the small thing. Another reason on why I think Lego won't answer this question is because they haven't answered this question on why still have Anakin and Obi-Wan Kenobi with their burn marks on Mustafar. And they have yet to answer that question. Now, I don't know for sure if it's been asked by someone in the community, but I'm pretty sure it has been asked by someone in the land. I believe I heard that summer, but I'm not sure by who. Change up Finch Dello, then why not change them too? Because it's not accurate. Like, you realize you make a mistake, you're supposed to fix it. And, like... They've done in the past, so I don't know why they can't do it again. It's whatever. It's a little peeve of me. I know. It's whatever. It's a little peeve of me. But I'm just saying, the odds of them answering this question are extremely slim. We've missed two amazing opportunities. An overpriced General Grievous Starfighter, which, by the way, great set, but it's very overpriced. We could have gotten him in that set. And rumors have it, and rumors are rumors, but they are pretty accurate most of the times. Like... It's one in a hundred chance that our rumor is wrong. And that's why I'm calling on every single one of my favorite influencers to really, you know, give me a little bit of push. Because I have a voice, yes, but I'm only so powerful. I don't have the influence yet. And I don't want to wait any longer. Let's be honest. I don't want to wait. I'm a very patient guy. I do stop motions. But 20 years, I don't want to wait anymore. So, let's start the movement. We want a phase to Cody. Use the hashtag down below. Hashtag we want face to Cody. That will make me so happy. I'm sure tons of people will be happy too. Hey, you don't even have to make a set like that you don't want to make. You just gotta put the figure in a set. Heck, even make a CMF with him or a polybag. I don't care. We want a face to Cody. So leave a comment down below. We want a face to Cody. Hashtag we want a face to Cody. Down below, start spamming the Lego social media and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. By the way, Lego, you're a great company. But we just want this thing.